Well, hello gang, and welcome back to Kenshi. If you were observant at the end of the last video, you might have seen all of these will spiders out here. Holy shit, that is a lot of them. Um, I don't see any attacking me, and I'm not entirely sure where the hell they came from. But that's way more than I can deal with, and they move 28 miles per hour. Um, everybody, sneak. I don't think you guys, I don't think my dogs can sneak, unfortunately. We're just gonna see if they'll very kindly leave. I don't want to fight them. Holy crap. So, will spiders, leviathans. I need to get the hell out of here. Old Empire Supply Outpost. We're gonna start making our way up through here, I think. Everybody, unstealth, group up, and let's head to the road. Okay, not, not right there. This is screwed. We've got skin bandits, will assholes. These guys at least can't chase me down. Nine miles per hour. Yeah, we're gonna get we're gonna try to get out of here how quick is everyone 26 28 21 but we're still limited by the bone hounds that's fine if i absolutely have to start booking it to run somewhere and hide oh hey gorillas uh then i'll pick them up and it looks like we got out of that place just in time uh oh, yeah, I figured that gorilla was going to see me. Go on your merry way. We're not food. We don't even taste that good. We're quite salty at the moment. A drifter walking around. At this point, where do I want to go? Do I need to make it back home? We've got people fighting. That's right, there was an attack on the way. I'm pretty sure there was, right? We've got a shopping assault that's there already, I think. Dust bandit demands. I don't care. If I see something like a holy nation assault, then I'll start to get worried. So... Let's just pick our way home through here. Slowly but surely. Maybe... Can find some outposts along this way. What do we have here? Skeleton bandits. Okay. Not as terrifying as skin bandits, but still quite strong. Might take my skin just the same. Souls down with a head wound. Bone jackals down. Not a big surprise. So we head into Gray Shelf. I'm not sure I've actually been to before. In much capacity. It looks like another offshoot of the Ashlands where ashes are just gonna pour down everywhere. Probably some more acid rain, huh? Okay, what about Grave Wraiths? They're definitely real. Yeah, they're real, all right. I mean, we've seen them at the base. We've lost friends to them. We've lost acquaintances. My question is, what do we have here? Stone, plates, repair kits. I don't need any of this. Skeleton muscle. A wrench. Yeah, we defeated the bandit demand. So what do we have here? Southern Hive versus Tech Hunters. Okay. We're in Southern Hive territory. It's good to know. Pretty sure they hate me. I'm not going to go help the Tech Hunters because I believe they've probably got it under control. Some more gorillas. It did look like I could hire the Tech Hunters, but to hell with it. 
I don't really want to piss any more any more money away. We've got ruins, we've got hives. We've got scary paths through the mountain with bad visibility. But you know what we don't have? Robots. Well, here we go. We just got ambushed by Southern Hive Drone Guard. 20 miles per hour. Prince! A Prince drone, I guess? Drone Guard, Drone Guard. All of these guys have really fucking good stats. Holy crap. Um, all of you... This is bad. Yeah, this is bad. Oh boy, I think that there's more. Yep, there's more coming from down there. Crap. We got, we just got pinched in. I'm, I may try to see if I can just blow through most of them. If the bone dogs get caught, so be it. This isn't a fight that I want to actually have, so. I guess try and make it up through here. Another good reason not to have mercenaries with me at this point. Somehow we are able to just barely pull ahead, it looks like. I have no doubt that at some point they will grow tired of the chase. Somebody got hit. Fess up. Who is it? It's Cat Dog who got hit in the leg. Diabetic just got hit. Do they have crossbow archers after us? Oh boy, there's more of them up here, I think. Yep, drone guard of the southern hive. I don't like this place either. So the nearest exit would be straight through here. I think. Set a path this way. These guys did set a good ambush. I was waiting for people to do that in other zones. These guys were wedged up in a cranny. Waiting for any dumbass to pass by. 19 miles per hour, 20, 20. It's just drone guards, it looks like. Well, no, don't stop. I know I'm not I'm not given enough move commands. It's my fault. We move faster than I uh, anticipate. How about a path? I mean, I need to stay away from the Royal Valley too, I imagine. How about a path this way. Split around the rock hoping to distract and confuse them. Okay, so we're down to being chased by three. I'm almost willing to fight just three. I don't see any more. Okay, swarm them. 52 st strength, 53 attack. Those are pretty good stats. You guys can attack that one. You guys can attack that one. You guys... Oh, shit, I've got three of them. Drone guard, drone guard. Come over here. Oh, shit, there's, there's more of them than I thought actually so we're gonna fight them I'm curious what they have we sh we have the numerical advantage which doesn't really mean too much in my opinion but we'll see everybody here just got whacked across the back Bruno and Jonathan take that guy out so those two are down moonshine see what they've got oh and I've got everybody pretty much set to hold and passive so, armored rags, armored rags, a leather hive vest. They've got pretty much nothing. Nasty raw meat, pole hammer. Okay. I was hoping they might have a good weapon or good armor or something. Uh, you no longer hold and stay passive. They take turns crushing his skull. And let's move for a moment before I do more healing. I don't want to stay in one place too long and 
We stood there fighting for long enough, so... I think I've got some injured people. Slowing me down. Everybody heal up. Who got a leg injury? Bruno, you did. Jonathan, you did. So, pretty much just Bruno and Jonathan. There we go. Now, can I please make it to Morn in one piece? Oh shit. Got drones moving right there. Way in the background. Not far enough for comfort, but what we have here. We've got some gorillas. That's fine. 20, 20, 20. Got more gorillas moving up here. I can easily outrun. I'm pretty sure that we can outrun them. I'm gonna hope that we can. Oh shit. More drone guards. I don't think the gorillas are chasing me, so. What if I sneak? If I sneak, let these guys go past me a little bit. Don't go too much further ahead. And we can just barely see him over there. Let them go their merry little way. Shopping assault has arrived. I kind of need to address that. Okay, now we move. Switch positions with them on the hillside here. Okay, I was gonna say, I really don't want to be chased down by those guys. Could probably mostly outrun them, but still. It's the thought that counts. Once I get to Morn, uh, I'll go address the shopping spree, the shopping assault. Is that, are we really gonna go up through here? Can't see anything, which is terrifying. High in the mountains, you find the mountain snow crag grieve wraith. Runs 65 miles per hour. I mean, maybe I'm being a little bit pessimistic and over overly worried, but wh whatever, right? Better to be safe than sorry. A bunch of bone hounds. An outrun. Now, the only thing I have to worry about here is a pack of beak things. And this time of night, they might actually just be sleeping. Which would be perfect for me to run into a nest of them. Let's get the hell inside. Hopefully nobody hates us. Uh, Ruffrin, you've still got a bounty by the Holy Nation, but... I mean, they're gonna hate me anyways. I think the only thing I would have to worry about, actually, is her being attacked by... Actually, yeah, that's kind of a concern. I was gonna say, anybody could actually attack her. I believe, and try to get the bounty. Oh. What I wanna do... Let's come back here. Just set here for a moment. There's camp beds. Bruno. Uh, you can go in a bed. Jonathan. You can be put in a bed. I think that's fine. All of you, basically... Um, just hold. Try not to run off and do anything. Ray, you're going to bed. Helmet hair, you're going to bed. Arund, 
Okay, you guys are all recovering from your wounds. That's fine. My dinosaurs are, of course, starving again. Because that's their... Their natural state. Are you telling me I'm already out of food out here? Holy crap. How did you even get inside, trash man? Blue? Can you pick him up? So, I need to do... I need to do some more food running. Hopefully I've got enough. I mean, these guys are going to be running me out of meat soon if they haven't already. Come here. And hell, didn't I even put a whole bunch of food in their inventory not, not that long ago? I doubt that was lost. I can't afford... to keep these damn things fed unless I... Like, babysit the food forever. Trash man, come eat. Dino, get over here. Denver, get over here. All of my animals, get over here. Selling tons of good stuff. What the hell is happening out here? I guess that's fair. I guess that's fair. I really need to go kill those things, actually. So that I, I make sure I have enough meat. Frank, you were getting further and further and further outside the base. Okay. I think we're fine. There's random shots getting fired, but I mean, that's pretty normal. So, all of you... Aurelius, how's your training going? You're up to 18 on crossbows. Good for you, man. Who knows, maybe someday you'll get recruited into this group too. I'm gonna need plenty more people to do expeditions on. To do expeditions with. So, let's see, we could... I mean, I could cut a path up through here and try to enter the burning forest and check it out, see what's there. Bruno. Okay, maybe I should actually pass some time. I'm going to kick back for a moment and drink some tea. While we hang out here. This is a very slow and painful proce process. Bruno, your leg is at 62. Jonathan... I guess you both can move at full speed now, which is... good enough. I want to get out of here, so... I think that's one of my mercenaries trying to follow me. I'm always gonna kind of chuckle at. Let's go ahead and... I guess leave this place. I don't really think there's anything here for me. I could send somebody up here to pick this lock, actually. Let's see. Moonshine. You're the best in the business, and this place does say it's abandoned. So you go up there. Everyone else, get ready to leave town. We've got a beak thing, of course. Because why wouldn't we? Now, if you sneak, it says nobody can see you. You failed? Come on, man. You're a professional here. You got this. This one, yep. Took a little bit longer, but he got it. So, let's see what's inside here. Abandoned headquarters. That I unfortunately can't buy. So, small emperor statue. Is that right? I'm gonna guess that I can't pick it up. Throw that on the ground. 
Small emperor statue. Stolen from great white gorilla. Is that right? A small sculpture of the holy nation's emperor. It's interesting. Got the holy flame, holy flame. So is this an outpost for the holy nation at one point? Oh, wow. Okay, so you're the guy, you're the thing I stole from. Great White Gorilla. A hundred, it runs at 24 miles per hour? Are you joking me? Crossbow parts, capacitors. Got wheat straw, there's more stuff up here. Smashed chest, a weapon cabinet. Bunch of weapon cabinets that are all... Empty. You're not really convincing me to go up here, game. You're not convincing me that there's anything worth it. Unless I'm missing something. A small empty barrel. A bed. Hey, there's beds in here. I could kill this thing and take this place over. Got five booze barrels. Empty. 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 Tons of knocked over training dummies. Okay. Well, I'm gonna be honest. The game didn't make a very good argument here. I do kind of feel bad about letting this thing out, but at the same time, I'm also curious... How is it here to begin with? How does this thing survive in this building? Uh, let's see, get over there, get over there. I know you can pick up your plate jacket. Okay, let's get out of here. We might return at some other point in time. To deal with that. Watch it now run out. Since I stopped stealthing. Kinda neat. Do not worry, existence is also suffering. Are you gonna come after me, beak thing? I'll fight one of you. Uh, let's set a path. Like I say, to the break in the map right there. It's busy eating... Like a tech hunter or a drifter of some type. And it's wounded enough that it knows not to fuck with anything else. My favorite type of big thing other than a dead one. Time to get that zoomed out view again. For my own safety. Look at that. What's that? Is that nothing? Oh, it's a beak thing nest. Okay. Uh, you can get beak thing eggs from beak thing nests and you can sell them. I don't think you can capture baby ones and train them, but... At some point, if I'm feeling particularly suicidal... Maybe we'll go and check it out. Send somebody like Charlos in there with turbo speed. Try to break out the other side. Like, look at this. This is a giant uh, skeleton skull. Like a robot skeleton. Look at all those beak things. We've seen their hands sticking out of the sand. We've seen giant heads now. We've seen giant. Look at that giant nest up there. Holy crap. No wonder this place is called the Bone Field. Say more beak things there. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to pick my way through here. Come this way. We're gonna we're gonna backtrack. Because both of those nests are gonna start to break up and fan out in large search patterns. Just because that's what nests do. We saw it in an earlier video, in fact, the very first time I came through here. With patience, you can eventually pick your way through them. So what the hell do I have here? Some type of abandoned outpost? We've got... Hey, it's Aim Higher! He's making rounds, apparently. Gorilla Bandits right there. Come back, aim higher. We want to hire you. Got tons of cats on me. So this is interesting. This is a wall B solo gate. 
there's absolutely nothing here other than that. Okay. This place has been picked clean long ago of anything useful. Uh, the high bone fields is not where we're going. I want to explore this place. What do we have up here moving? Blood spiders. Wonderful. So, the burning forest I know has two things now. Bo uh, blood spiders and beak things. And that is a lot of blood spiders. We've got swamp raptors right there. Uh, swamp raptors and blood spiders, I believe, will fight, right? There they go. Swarming into each other. Oh, goody, and this place does have acid rain. Well, this is kind of a nightmare. Um, I guess I'll try to do my best to scout through here. I'm going to... This, the visibility here sucks, too. Wow. I'm going to presume that any lab we run across and find in this place... Probably going to be infested with blood spiders. God, the visibility here is garbage. I have to zoom in because, again, blood spiders could be small and tiny. It's hard to see them through the trees when you're so zoomed out. Swamp Raptors, I'm pleased to see. They're fairly passive. They're actually kind of quick. Oh wait, no, I was looking at Murder Face's speed, okay. Is that something? No. It is not. It looked like it could have been a nest of something, but it's just a fern. Uh, what do we have here? I'm not really close to the ruin. Um, yes, I know we should take shelter. Quickly. Fortunately, it's not going to happen. Contract with Mercenary Guild has ended. I'm going to assume that's the mercenary guilds at my base. But it might not be. Okay. So I'm a little bit worried. I don't see anything but swamp raptors moving. Uh, get over here. scout this place out. Oh, goody. Look at that. Functional I2. So this is another heavily infested robot ruin that I can't really do too much with with this group. Remember, I don't like to get into fights where the majority of my group is going to be definitely knocked unconscious. So, what is this? A wandering I-2? Runs at 22 miles per hour, an old I-1. They're all out on patrol. We know that there's a ton more inside. Uh, let's make our way north. I was hoping I could get a name for this place at least. If I get close enough. Maybe I can't get a name for it until I go inside, which I'm not going to do. Because that is suicidal. Okay. This place has me on edge. You can't tell in my voice. So we got swamp raptors. Is that something? No, that's a fern. More swamp raptors. We discovered farm ruins. Is that right? Well, what if I set a path here? Okay, still have to go the long way around. How about here? 
Right through the middle of a pack of swamp raptors. We pet them as we run past. They don't seem to mind. They're not used to seeing humans, so... Wow, if I want to get down here anywhere, I have to go all the way over here. I don't like little choke points like that. So, let's go check out this farm ruin, I guess. I can kind of see it up ahead. Uh, before I get too close... Where, where's the blood spiders at? Where's the beak thing is at? This might make kind of a safe place to rest. Everybody sneak. So, what do we have laying around? Absolutely nothing. United Cities residencies. At one point in time. Unfortunately, it really is a farm ruin. There is nothing here. No safes. No building materials. No wheat shafes. So, I guess I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Whenever we come back, I'm uh, going to make our way back north until we get back to Bitten Labor. And, uh, home sweet home where I can relax for a couple videos. Either way, I'll see you then.